Okay, part two of the tutorial for Google Pages. In part one, I was just beginning to edit the page. You can click and essentially add any information you'd like simply by typing it in. Cadre 9, EDTC 517, just another way to identify this page. Come down here into the main body of the content. I'm going to again open this up so you can see a little bit more of it. This is where I would uh, type information about Joe Bruzes or EDTC 517. You can always change the appearance by highlighting in much the same way as you would do in a Microsoft Word document, choosing different colors. There's a few different fonts to choose. It's pretty much the same selection. Um, formatting, bold. One nice addition that I do like here is that you can add images fairly quickly by clicking on the image button. Browsing, and this is going to look at your computer's hard drive where you can select an image. It uploads the image. That is in fact the image I would like. Selected. Let's see what's happening down here. And there is a button, unfortunately you can't see it right now. At the bottom right it says add image. I'm going to click that button. The image is added to the page. Fairly simple. To be able to see your changes, hit the publish button at the top. Your page has been published. View it on the web. A new browser opens and there you have it. With my image complete.